Hi everyone, welcome back to Signature's Life. Those who are watching this channel for the first time, please subscribe and press the bell icon for more updates. The real subject is a result of two colliding galaxies located 500 million light years away within the constellation of Ursa Major. It was discovered by American astronomer Nicola Ziomiel of the Lick Observatory on 13 March 1940 using the Crossley reflector. When first discovered, Miel's subject was described as a peculiar nebula shaped like a question mark. Originally theorized to represent a galaxy reacting with the intergalactic medium, it is now thought to represent the collision of two galaxies resulting in a new object consisting of a ring-shaped galaxy with a tail emerging from it. It is thought that the collision between the two galaxies created a shock wave that initially drew matter into the center which then formed the ring. R148 was imaged by the Hubble Space Telescope as part of a survey of what are thought to be colliding galaxies. The image was taken with wide field and planetary camera to instrument. It was released along with 59 other images of this type in 2008 for that space telescope's 18th anniversary. Relational rings are formed when a smaller galaxy crashes through the center of a large galaxy. Just as throwing a stone into a pond creates an outwardly moving circular wave, gravitational density wave is generated at the point of impact throwing matter out into a ring shape. Most collisional ring galaxies manage to hold onto a nucleus in the center of the ring, but sometimes the disturbance is so large that the nucleus is completely destroyed. It is incredibly rare to see the galaxy collision actually taking place. Nicknamed Mir subject, this ring is located in the constellation of Ursa Major, approximately 450 million light years away. Meal subject is a result of two colliding galaxies located 450 million light years away from the Milky Way. Aside from its unique shape produced by galactic collision, this galaxy is among one of the many galaxies rendered reachable through second generation wormhole generators. Many confederacy ships pass through the wormhole leading to the galaxy, only to stumble upon a treasure trove of intelligent life with intelligent species on nearly half of the planets in the galaxy. The most advanced of the species discovered is only starting to experiment with space flight. Although not involved in the first war, a century-long conflict called the Warden Heaven Split, the territory in the galaxy that humans claimed into three separate empires. These empires are known as the Holy Church of God, the Temple of Amaterasu, and the Avalokiteswara Empire. The Holy Church of God is an extremist cult spanning at least 1200 star systems. The members of the cult believe that the genuine side of all non-believers and all alien species as well as a number of other things is the only way to keep the Antichrist from being born. The cult itself is shrouded in mystery and is desperately trying to expand beyond its current borders. Only being held back by the combined force of the Temple of Amaterasu, the Avalokiteswara Empire, and the Bela Collective. At this point in time, the cult seems like it is about to either implode internally or splinter apart spectacularly. The largest of the bunch, the Temple of Amaterasu, spans three quarters of the blue part of Miel's object, with some grassroots in the galaxy's tail. The religion of the empire itself is very similar to how Shinto was during the 15th century. This empire is the most open of the three, with several million members of the empire being alien species, both from real subject and from other galaxies, with humans making up the majority. The Avalokiteswara empire is not as open as the temple of Amaterasu, only allowing certain alien species that are not known from causing any trouble for their human neighbors. It occupies the remaining quarter of the blue part of Mio's subject. 